Hello, fellow Daz Studio enthusiasts. This is Not From This World, and I want to welcome you back to another Daz tutorial. Now, today I want to address something that I've gotten a few questions about, and uh, I've made several videos talking about creating morphs, but we need to address an issue about how to delete them. So if you've got morphs that you want to get rid of, it can be kind of a pain to locate where those morphs are to totally get rid of them. So an example here would be Milica. And if you look, I've got Milica. And if I look under her morphs, I have a bunch of morphs that are just kind of everywhere. So, uh, Many that I've created for comics, like I gave a girl a belly wound at one point in time. I have a, hug, a hugger bulge that I created for one of my previous tutorials. Um, I have this waist test that I did to create a morph for one of my um, tutorial videos. So we have a lot of these custom morphs that we may want to eventually get rid of. So for example, this waste test, I don't need this. And so I wanna get rid of it. So how do I do that? Where do I go? We also may create morphs in Blender that we also want to delete and get rid of. So I'm gonna show you how to do that as well. That's actually a lot easier. So let's look at how we can get rid of morphs or honestly any other thing that we have added like a pose or a shader we can get rid of anything the trick is we just have to find the correct folder so the first thing i'm going to want to do is come up to my daz studio formats we're going to click on that and then under my library just right click and go down to browse to folder location. And when you do that, it's gonna open up the folders where you save a bunch of stuff. So my presets, the people, my figures, a lot of the things that I have created are gonna be stored in these folders. Now morphs are gonna be located in data. And then you go to Daz 3D Go to Genesis 8 or Genesis 9, whichever your morph is in. Select that, go to female, and then see my morphs are right there. So this is gonna be all the morphs I have. So I've gotta scroll down until I find my vendor name. So I have saved everything in my vendor name, which is not from this world. So I'm gonna select that. And then see, here are my morphs that I have created and saved into Daz Studio. So now if I wanna get rid of one of these, all I have to do is select it and then just delete it. And that will get rid of any morph that I have created in the past. Also, if I created some morphs, let's say in Blender, and I wanna get rid of those, for me, that's very easy because I created a Blender Morph folder that's right here. So for example, in my first Blender tutorial, I made this troll morph. And now all I have to do is just go in there. I can select it and delete it. Like I don't need this bra morph anymore. I was playing around with it. So I can just delete that. And then that gets rid of that morph. All right. So that's about it. It's a little complicated, you know, some simple little thing becomes kind of a pain in the butt to find because you're going through all these Daz files and folders trying to find where your morphs are. So I hope that kind of helped out a little bit. And uh, just for fun, Milica is all set to be rendered. So we're going to render her up. And uh, until next time, I hope you have a wonderful day. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and give me a comment or two. I'd love to know what you are doing in Daz and how I can help you. All right, take care.